Whether you like it or not, the one that dominates the handgun market right now is striker-fired pistols. They appeal to many shooters, primarily because they are easy to use. The trigger requires minimal pressure to engage it, and they often have short resets, enabling quick follow-ups. Despite their popularity, my love for hammer-fired pistols never disappeared. That ain't gonna happen. In fact, the first gun I fired was a hammer-fired pistol, in the form of a Colt 1911, so you can just understand my adoration for this type of handgun. Fortunately, many hammer-fired handguns are still in production, ensuring that you have an option if you get bored with your striker-fired tools. What's up, everyone? This is your boy Ted from Line 45. In this episode, I will be showing you some of the top 9mm hammer-fired handguns in the market right now. CZ-75B the CZ-75B is the first CZ pistol that I'm going to feature here. Well, this shouldn't be a surprise since there was a point in time when this gun was considered the peak of hammer-fired pistols. Now, there are multiple versions of the CZ-75 right now. The one we have here is the CZ-75B. It's basically the CZ-75, but it has a firing block already, which is the reason for its B designation. Meanwhile, the CZ-75BD is a CZ-75 with a firing pin block and decocker, but no manual safety. If you see a CZ-75SA, that simply means single action, and DAO obviously stands for double action only without any external levers. The CZ-75B is available in 9mm and 40 S&W chamberings, though the 9mm is arguably the most popular. With the 9mm model, you will get a capacity of 16 rounds. Since the gun has been designed for duty use, its overall design is free from bananas. From the ergonomics to the controls, there are no frills. It's also crafted from steel, which gives a nice weight to it. It's a little over 2 pounds, has a width of 1.4 inches, and spans a total length of 8.1 inches. Meanwhile, the 4.6-inch hammer-forged barrel can withstand a beating. The sheer size of the gun makes it easy to control. Pair it with its light slide and low-bore axis, and you have a gun you can shoot with ease. Recoil isn't an issue with this pistol, which in turn ascertains its accuracy on long distances. Its double action, single action trigger is a case of so so. The single action is light and crisp, with only minimum take up. The double action feels like the traditional heavy double action many of you are used to. Everything is supposed to be great, except for the fact that its trigger has a long reset. Other than that, the CZ-75B is a solid hammer-fired pistol to own. Sig Sauer P226 Elite In general, the P226 is a solid choice for a hammer-fired pistol. It's one of the guns that puts Sig Sauer on the pedestal of handgun manufacturing. It's extremely reliable, as my P226 has already surpassed 7,000 rounds, with only a minimum of flaws, mostly due to me. What I want to recommend here is the P226 in the Enhanced Elite configuration. Basically, the setup includes an E2 molded grip, while its SRT trigger has already been installed alongside its fantastic night sights. The gun is a suitable choice for concealed carry. It can become an alternative to Glock 19, except that you need to get used to its weight first. Once you do, this gun becomes a trustworthy personal defense pistol. Instead of a polymer frame, the P226 is built around an alloy frame with a nitron finish, which is wedded to a stainless steel slide, resulting in an overall weight of 34 ounces. Again, this isn't the lightest pistol for carry purposes, but its weight ensures that it shoots flatly and steadily. The total length of the gun is 7.7 .7 inches and is equipped with a 4.4 inch barrel. Its standard magazine has a capacity of 15 rounds of 9 millimeters. There's a need for you to break in its double-action, single-action trigger. It's required so that you can make it butter smooth. The trigger also has a minimal take-up and is overall predictable. Press checks on the slide are pretty easy, thanks to its front serrations. Regardless of what situation you are in, you can guarantee that you can manipulate and control the P226 skillfully. Beretta 92FS The Beretta 92FS is a chunky hammer-fired pistol. It has been in the market for quite some time, and many shooters immediately recommend it to other people if they want something big, powerful, and accurate. The standard capacity of the Beretta 92FS is 15 rounds, but there are magazines available for it that can hold up to 30 rounds of 9mm. 
I said that this Italian gun is huge, right? Well, its overall length is 8.5 inches, while its barrel is close to 5 inches long. The lengthy design of the pistol gives it a generous sight picture. Meanwhile, its empty weight is already 34 ounces, given that it's not a polymer gun. Surely that's not a problem since it gives the gun the ability to soak its recoil. At the same time, the 92FS is designated for duty use. The more rugged and hefty it is, the better. Ever since its existence, the Beretta 92FS has already proven its accuracy and reliability. It's also a comfortable gun to hold, even without further customizations. The rear of its grip, for example, has a beaver tail that keeps your hands protected from the hammer. And by design, the 92FS enforces a natural high grip, thus making slide or hammer bites a thing of the past. Perhaps the only downside of this Beretta pistol is that it doesn't have a rail for accessory attachment. Many modern guns have rails already, so their absence means that you can't slap lights or lasers on them. Fortunately, there are aftermarket options that let you replace the stock grips and have a new one that comes with a rail. Staccato P. Double stack 1911s, or more commonly known as 2011 pistols, have been popularized by Staccato. One of their most notable releases is the Staccato P. This is a full-size, duty-ready, hammer-fired handgun that is known for its impeccable accuracy and reliability. The grip of the Staccato P is wider than your conventional 1911 pistol, allowing it to take 17-round or 20-round magazines. This is a huge improvement from the casual 8 to 10 rounds of single-stack 1911 guns, which are usually chambered in 45 ACP. This Staccato pistol, similar to other Staccato guns, has remarkable engineering. All of its parts have been fitted precisely so that no wriggling room for errors can exist. They are also made to be durable. They can take a beating and still shoot with laser-like accuracy. And take note, it manages to hit sub-2-inch groupings from 25 yards without the help of red dots. With a price of $2,000 or so, the Staccato P is not exactly the first gun you'll think of for personal defense or home defense. However, its quality makes it an excellent long-term investment. I am confident that it can withstand the test of time, and even if it passes the 10,000 round mark, its performance will stay just the same. And it's not difficult to operate this pistol either. If you know your way with 1911 pistols, you can get the hang of the Staccato P quite easily. If you are looking for a concealed carry counterpart, you can go check out the Staccato C2 and CS, CZ Shadow 2. And my top hammer-fired handgun is the CZ Shadow 2. I love my CZ pistols, especially if we are talking about the OG CZ-75. This particular platform is consistently cloned because of its innovative design, superb ergonomics, and consistent accuracy down the range. The original Shadow resembles the standard CZ-75 or the SP-01, but the Shadow 2 is an entirely new species of its own. When it was commercially released, the gun itself was touted as the flagship competition handgun of CZ, because really, this gun is meant to be competition ready in the first place. In fact, it's safe to say that this hammer-fired gun has overtaken the USPSA ever since it was taken to the test, given that it is reasonably priced and downright accurate. It has a stellar shootability, primarily because it is a heavy gun. This one weighs about 46.5 ounces, so much of the recoil and muzzle rise are eliminated. Plus, it has a precise inside-the-frame slide design that ensures its flatness while shooting due to the low-bore axis it provides. It's also worth noting that the area where its dust cover is located has substantial weight on it. This is not a design by accident, as this feature counteracts any muzzle flip. Hence, sights can return to zero swiftly, and you can shoot the gun rapidly without losing precision. At 25 yards, the Shadow 2 can attain sub-2-inch groupings even without using red dots. Also, it cycles different 9mm rounds with zero malfunctions, which is a testament to its inherent reliability. Plus, its trigger is just amazing. It's crisp, smooth, and resets predictably. The CZ Shadow 2 has a capacity of 17 rounds of 9mm and an MSRP of $1,099. It's also available in the Shadow 2 Compact model. If you want a competition gun, you can carry it around. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more gun videos like this, just click the subscribe button and notification bell. Take care and stay safe.